Andrew? Um, I believe this is my final question, and admittedly, it's a two-parter, but it's the same topic. Uh, Elon Musk says that Tesla will start to offer insurance for its cars and can price it better than a typical insurance company because of the data it collects from all the vehicles on the road. You've talked about the threat of autonomous vehicles on the insurance business, but what about the threat to Geico of automobile companies themselves getting into the insurance business? And on a very similar topic, Tesla recently announced that they're shifting to an online-only sales model, and several traditional auto dealerships are also reducing their property holdings as car buyers increasingly use smartphones and the internet to shop for cars. What does this portend for Berkshire Hathaway Automotive? Yeah. Uh, actually, General Motors had a company for a long time called Motors Insurance Company, and, and various companies have tried it. I would say that uh, uh, the success of of the insurance company of the auto companies getting into the insurance business are probably about as likely as the success of the insurance companies getting into the auto business. Uh, it, 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 uh, I worry much more about progressive than all of the auto company possibilities that I could see in terms of getting insurance business. It's, it's not an easy business uh, at all. And uh, uh, I would bet against any company in the auto business being any kind of, a, out, uh, of an unusual success. The idea of using telematics in terms of studying, people, studying people's driver's habits, that's, that's spreading quite quite uh, widely, and uh, uh, it, is an important, it is important to have data on how people drive, how hard they brake, how much they swerve, all kinds of things. Uh, so I don't doubt the value of the data, but I don't think that the, the auto companies will have any, any advantage to that. I don't think they'll make money in the insurance business. The, uh, using the Internet to shop for cars is like you know, using the Internet for shopping for everything. It's another competitor. And, uh, uh, there's no question that people will look for better ways. Now, the gross margin on new cars, on new cars, is about six percent or thereabouts. So there's 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 not lots of room in the game, but but that's that will be a method, and that will sell some cars. And that there are you know it, it's 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 another competitor, but, uh, but I don't think it it destroys the auto dealer who takes good care of the customers and is is there to service the customers and no uh, it, it it's not a it's not an overwhelming threat but it's obviously something that's going to be around and we'll sell some cars charlie again nothing <laughs>